You're my other half, don't you understand? No matter what you do, you always gonna be my boo. I love you, yeah. I love you. No, run me till I'm about to come. I see you are about to climb. Makes oh girl, don't be shy. I'll be chilling in my bed when I want Cause when you call, I just wanna know I'm gonna keep in my head and go Every time you call, I'm a little far I'll be chilling with my friends <clears throat> See me somewhere real but anyways, that's crazy. It's all about what you're going for, but uh, you'll have one song on the album that that's like that kind of style. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That SoundCloud, yeah. SoundCloud rap peak level style. Mm -hmm. But um, T Smart's beats are definitely more like well engineered, in my opinion. Yeah. So yeah, no, I like this song. I like all the all the beats that you brought from T Smart so far. Let's get it. <clears throat> Actually, all the beats that you brought so far, even that Blanco one, I think that Blanco one was just, you know, too much bass boost, but... Ready? Uh-huh. So my dad, he's, uh, he makes beats and stuff, so he was always, like, making beats in his room, and my mom, she was, like, always singing to Mary J. Blige and Faith Evans and stuff. So I was always like listening to her sing and listen to my dad make beats and like one day I was like writing stuff in my room. My mom found it. She was like, yo, he's actually a good writer. So um, I think around that time is when I found my calling. He's got everybody on there with him. He's got John Legend. He's got Missy Elliott. Alicia <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's got that little Timberlake boy. He's on there. Yeah. Please give it up for Dave Sean. <laughs> How was it that you first heard about Jay again? So, I'm not too sure, but I have a friend named Laura, and she, I think she might have reposted him, or it might have been because of Rick Beal, because I follow him, so he, I think he might have shot his video. And I think that's, it's probably a combination of that, because it's like, from different places, like, a lot of people were posting him, so I was like, man, who is this guy? Like, I need to meet him. So I was like, oh shoot. To meet this guy, and he yeah, turned out to be a pretty nice guy. Pretty cool. A lot quieter in person, I'd say. Yeah. <laughs> but I think that's normal with artists. It's like that's why they make the music, because it kind of helps them express themselves. Yeah, like in person, I'm like shy and reserved, but my music, I can just express myself. Everybody wants to know who's Jay messing with. What guy has he turned out? What download guy was he messing with? So I feel like, feel like I'm putting all that into this album. Like everything you want to know about me is on this album. Like when I'm feeling down, I just write. I just want to go in my room, lock myself in, write, and just get all my feelings out. And then I put on a beat. And I just like freestyle over the beat or like go Sometimes over the lyrics on the I wrote. Verses, he'd be doing like <laughs> some crazy. Like I've. I've Sometimes they come in here with his verses and I'll record part of it and then space it out and make it like almost like Lil Wayne used to rap and just like just like one part and then big pause and I'll do a bunch of reverb and a bunch of reverse effects and stuff and then Oh when I do my like high pitch ones and shit. Yeah, just shit like that. Yeah. And then I turn those into verses. Yeah. Cause though like on uh How to Get Away Get Away with Murder and a couple other songs like that, those are verses. Yeah. Like what they are. Like, I was just hitting, like, my high notes and stuff. Like, but then I feel like on that song, I almost turned that into a chorus, because I, yeah. I made it repeat. I liked it so much. Yeah. I've been, I've been doing music all my life, too. I knew he was a natural, you know, and um, after a minute, he recorded a, a mixtape. Mm -hmm. I think it was with you the first yeah, time. Yeah, it was a mixtape. And the shit went hard. He hated it. But <laughs> yeah, it's hidden. But <laughs> but it, it it was good, you know what I'm saying, and it showed shades of what he's t what he's metamorphosized into, even in the beginning.
So I have this show to do here, Anchorage, Alaska. It's a fashion show. I'm just showing off Anchorage downtown boutiques. I'm going to be performing my song, Snow City. The show's called Snow City Threads. So that's super dope. I wanted to correlate everything. But so the cool thing about that is I see my poster up for the show. This is so dope. I never like expected this. This lets me know, you know, dreams are real. Dreams do come true. Just seeing my poster up is just so amazing, you know. And not just one poster, two posters, you know, the after party for the show with me, Brother Buffalo, DJ B1, and Think Twice. We about to kill it. Yeah. What's it feel like for you to actually have like your face plus over the downtown anchor? It's so crazy. Like, I don't know. It's unreal and getting like my, my phone's blowing up. Like, yo, I see your face downtown. Like. It's so unreal. I would never thought this would happen to me, you know? Okay. And then maybe stop at the same You don't stop this one, but maybe stop at this one here again. That will be your last one. Okay. And then maybe as soon as you're off stage, the next one. That's the idea, yeah. We'll only have one model on the floor at one time. So it keeps, keeps the flow going as uh, it is a very fast show. But also uh, the confusion is not there. The focus is entirely on you while you're on the floor, and then we'll everybody will cheer for you, we'll move on to the next one, and then this whole thing will be over faster than you can think. I feel like I'm a boring person, but music was like my savior. Like, bless me, and it's my gift from God. So that's the only thing that helps me. Cause like, I'll be honest, like this might be like too much, but I don't think like I'll be alive if it wasn't for music. Like. I believe that he's going to go very far. All he has to do is stay himself, embrace himself and his, and his, and his swag, you know what I'm saying? And people love it. Yeah. to this album, find healing. Um, I want to help other, you know, guys like me, like, other gay guys like messing with like these download dudes. Like, I want y'all to like cry to this album. I have like dudes hit me up. Uh, Damn, I can't wait to put, put the, uh, when you put this album out so I can, you know, find some inspiration and find some healing. So that's why I'm making it. It's coming. I want to thank Mark, you, for putting stuff together. Um, I want to thank Brandon for filming a lot of stuff for me, Janessa, 
a lot of my friends, let me see, I got a lot of friends. All my friends, all my girlfriends, I love y'all. Y'all, you're too many to name. I just wanna say don't give up, keep pushing, um, keep putting out content, um, make your voice heard, be everywhere, and don't take no for an answer. No, yeah. Every no makes you, makes you um, wanna go harder. Make it as motivation, so.